how did this film uh, come to be, man? Where did the idea come from? Just, just take me back to, to point one. Okay. Uh, well, first, let me, let me just preface all of that by saying Barry Jenkins. Yeah. How's that? Not bad. Thank you to Bettina Fisher and Dina and Randy and everybody at the Academy uh, for putting on this event. We appreciate that. I had, I had come to Hollywood, I'll tr make this as brief as possible. I had come to Hollywood on a job working for the Hughes Brothers. And I arrived and got fired immediately. <laughs> and I had early, <laughs> which is, you know, if you know the, anyway, it's Alan and I was, <laughs> I, I had went, before I had uh, 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 moved to Los Angeles, I had sort of been a kind of amateur poet and been involved in a world that was very similar to what depicted in the movie. And I just sort of kept the, the world of that in the back of my mind as something that might be interesting, but I never really thought that I could do anything with it. I came here to write a different kind of movie, and I had met Helena Echegoyen, Helena Perez now, but at the time she's Helena Echegoyen. She's out here somewhere. Where, Where are, are you, you, Helena? Okay, there's Helena Echegoyen Perez. Hi. Okay, who was an executive at New Line at the time, and so we had had a uh, uh, we knew each other just sort of around, and she said, "What are you doing?" I had written a movie. I gotten fired off this job or whatever, and I said, "Well, I have this idea." Um, so it's you know, she's a photographer and he's a poet and. I don't know, they fall in love or something like that, and blah, blah, blah. She was like, write that. Literally like that. And I was like, really? I don't think that's something I could get really through Hollywood. That's, you know, I was, came here to write The French Connection. That's really what I wanted. <laughs> and she was like, no, 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 I want to see that movie. Write that. So I wrote it. And she helped me. And then Nick Wexler, where's Nick Wexler? Right there. That guy. <laughs> Nick, Nick. Yo. Nick. Yo, Nick Wexler, that guy is a Hollywood legend yes, right he there. Is. That guy has produced every major director of the last 25 years. Thank you, Nick. Thank you. Nick. Thank and you, Nick. little old me. Thank you, and so we wouldn't be here without Nick and Helena and some other folks as well. Julia's on the panel. She'll speak as well. So anyway, so Nick uh, had gotten a hold of the script, said he wanted to produce it, and then we set it up at New Line. And Helena got it through the system. And we set it up in, they made my deal in June. And we were greenlit and shooting in January. Right. Anybody who works in show business knows. That's insane. I thought it was like, Nick was like, hey, pal, you don't understand. It doesn't really work like this. I'm, it's my first movie. And I'm like, Nick, what are you talking about? It's me. Like, I came here with a dream. And that's how it goes. And blah, blah, blah. <laughs> And he's like, you don't understand. It doesn't. It doesn't work like this. And it. And after 20 years, it doesn't. <laughs> but it did that time. So that's the. There you go. That's my long story about how we got started. And in six months, we we were making the movie. 